What's up guys, just chilling at the crib. I just laced up my fresh Nikes. Check them out. These are uh, black Nike SB Dunk Mid Pros. Uh, I'm lacing these up because I need new shoes to skate in. My gray ones uh, that are just like these. Actually, they're the same, but uh, this is like a leather material. Hi, Mike. Hi. Uh, this is a leather material rather than like a suede on other ones. Those aren't the other Nikes. Uh, these are my Osiris's. I started to skate these, and look, that was literally like five minutes of skating. I started to wear a hole in them. But yeah, I'm about to head to the skate park and get a session in uh, and go ahead and start skating these. Uh, these actually feel a little bit more like broken in from the start uh, than the blue ones does because like the blue ones are like so stiff still. Even, like I still haven't fully broke them in, it feels like. Uh, but I guess maybe it's just because it's leather or something uh, that it feels a little bit better and more comfortable like right from the start of wearing them. But yeah, what you guys think? This look pretty sick. Yay! I got the skate park completely to myself. Or at least for now. Just sit on my board. It's always weird like skating new shoes for like the first day or two. Uh, but I don't know, actually it feels pretty good. See if I can land a kickflip. Oh, that was hard. <laughs> They're like super grippy, like right when you first start skating them. Let's skate. I think I like skating uh, these black ones more than I did the gray ones. Like they already feel pretty good. Hopefully they just last for a while though. That's one thing that's worrying me. My gray ones lasted for a good while. I did put shoe goo on them, but like that they're already breaking in this fast <laughs> means they probably won't last that long either. Let's hope they will. All right guys, this is Ty Johnson. Oh my gosh. Oh! oh. Ah, Why can't I do this? me gay. Watch your gay tricks. Okay, watch the Ooh, no. Gay. G gay. As you can see, there's time off on his skateboarding adventure. Okay, here he goes. Here he goes. Justin is just like running around and recording stuff. Wait, why is our camera so blue? I just realized that. I think Gray changed the settings on it. Holy crap, that's really blue. I'm blue dot and dee dot and da dot and dee and dot. I gotta change that. That's really blue. There we go. Much better. Thanks, Gray, for changing the colors in the camera. I love you too. Hey, right, bye. <laughs> this little guy is uh, gonna come with me. I'm leaving the park now. I'm gonna drop him off at his house. That's right, you put your seatbelt on. It's safe. Safety first, right? Yep. Where's your helmet? You left it in the back. Go get it. Watching some Breaking Bad on Netflix. Uh, I've been watching it a little bit lately because Gray's been playing some of like, we're not on the latest episodes, right? We're in like season three. <laughs> There's like five or six seasons. There's five seasons, I believe. Is this, this is the last season though, right? Five? I think it's ending. Uh, but yeah, I, I mean, I've watched it. I watched through the first, like, season and a half, maybe. I mean, yeah, a little bit past the first season. It's good. It's, like, a good show, but it's, it's just... It's just very slow. Yeah, it's so dragged like, out. There are times where they're literally walking to the couch, 
like for five minutes, and I'm like, dude. I mean, I know that is a part of the show, no, though. Know. It's built to build suspense, to build like, and to get you into the character. Yeah, to like let you feel what they're feeling. I don't know. I just don't like it for that reason. Uh, I mean, it's Honestly, good, I but I don't feel any character connection whatsoever because of the slowness. It yeah. Makes me mad. The, th the whole five seasons they have could have been done in two seasons easily. Easily, they could have cut out so I much stuff. Hear so much shit. Oh no, I'm not hating on it. Well, I don't really like the show that much, but I haven't watched it. It's pretty good. Um, it's starting to get good mid season three, so I'm like, yeah, finally. I hate when people say that though. Oh, it's it's a good show. You just have to watch the first three seasons, and then it gets good. I don't want to watch three seasons of the show. Like, skip two, season three, and like then. But, yeah. But yeah, what do you guys think of Breaking Bad? Or what's your favorite TV show on right now? I'm not really one to follow like a, a series of TV shows where you have to like watch every episode every week or whatever when it comes out. I like a show where I can just pick up and watch it like anytime and it's just like a one individual like, episode. Like, like what? Lie to me. Lie to me. That's that a freaking. Amazing show. Uh, I'm so sad that they Love that show. The best show. Yeah, that was a freaking Game amazing show. Game of Thrones, people. Game of Thrones is the best. Oh my god. The absolute best. Yeah. Have what? What, what TV Don't shows complain. are you into right now? What? There's tons of. Boobs. Yeah, there's also a lot of freaking there ding dongs too. There was one time when there was a wiener. There's a, a lot, lot of ding dongs. No. No, there was not. Ain't trying to see no ding dongs. <laughs> The medieval ding dongs of that. <laughs> We're gonna head out now to Olive Garden. Grizzly Gray has been wanting. I just want a salad right now. Salad. Like, just want salad. <laughs> it's five bucks, and I want soup from there. It's cool because you can go and get soup for five bucks, get a water with it. And that's be, all you pay. We're gonna be the assholes that come in late at night and order nothing but soup and salad <laughs> refillables, and they're just like, hey, Damn it. don't make it a, such a great deal. Five bucks for all you can eat salad or soup. And if you have a good waiter, uh, if you get soup, they'll let you like change out different uh, kinds of soup because it's all like the same thing there's it's, it's unlimited soup either way so what does it matter if they're giving you a different kind focus 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 Ali G we going in we going in eat that soup eat that salad uh, uh. I always eat the, the Zupa Descana it's freaking delicious and the breadsticks are really good to dip in it uh, but Gray always gets is it chicken ganochi is that how you say it I don't think I don't think it's the right pronunciation of that Nochi. Nochi? <laughs> I think we're both saying it wrong. Uh, but I kind of want that. God, both of them are so good. Hmm. Maybe they'll let me switch it out if I get if I get a few bowls of Zupa Toscana. Then the chicken ganochi. Maybe they'll let me switch it for that. How's your salad? Are they really good? Worth five bucks? Definitely. Uh, I've already ate one bowl of Zupa Toscana soup and uh, about a breadstick and a half. One bowl of soup down. There's many more to go. That's all good. Gotta make room in there for more soup. <laughs> Best waiter ever gave us pool instead of just two. Yeah, you don't want to see that. He's on the phone with that. <laughs> so if you would like, I'm hosting a little giveaway on my website, pirategrayson.com. There are going to be two winners, and it's for the book Confessions. The Private School Murders, and this is the second book for the series. The first book is Confessions of a Murder Suspect by James Patterson. So if you want, go check it out. I'll have a link in the description for you. But please don't enter if you're not going to read the books because I don't want it to be just somebody wants to just win something. I want somebody who's going to actually read the books because they're very good. I started reading it actually this morning and I could not put it down for like two hours. <laughs> And yeah, then I started dozing there's two off. Winners too. Yeah, there's two winners. So the first winner wins a big prize where they win the copy, a copy of both the books, a t-shirt, and a journal, because the whole book is kind of like this woman is or this girl really is a detective. Kind of like it reminds me a lot of Nancy Drew. When as I was reading, I was like, oh my god, I love this because I, I used to read the Nancy Drew books all the time as a kid. So it's kind of like that. And then the second winner will win two copies, a copy of the first book and the second book. And yeah, go so check it out. Enter. Good luck to you. May Will the you odds win? be ever in your favor. <laughs> Just found the dog whistle like sitting around. Mac never really reacted to this though, did he? No, I don't remember. He's eating his food though. Are you blowing hard enough? He doesn't care. <laughs> oh my god, he farted! <laughs> Max, stop <laughs> farting! Your farts smell so bad! How do you clean out a dog's stinky butt?
They literally <laughs> smell like a nasty, dirty baby diaper. <laughs> I think it's the new food that we got him because it's the natural fish food or whatever because the other food he was allergic to. That stinks. His <laughs> farts have been smelling like that for the last like two weeks, two, three weeks. No, months Horrible. No. no yeah. Not that bad. <laughs> It's gotten worse. <laughs> they have gotten increasingly worse. Something has crawled up in Max's butthole and died. Or babies in there just pooping all the time. It's like Johnny. There, no, 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 no. There's something in both of their stomachs that is <laughs> no, dead No, I in think there. Johnny, honestly, I feel like Johnny, I feel like he ate his twin in the womb and the twin's like stinking and dead inside of him and it won't leave because it's like attached itself to his stomach <laughs> and it's just dead. And he's just farting that stench That's out. What it smells like. I honestly feel like Johnny's is way worse than Max. Yeah. I can withstand a, di a dirty baby diaper compared to his toxins. So both of them are disgusting. <laughs> Johnny's parts are the worst part. <laughs> worst smell I've ever smelled in my life. Yeah. I can't think of Your a worse smell. Like ridiculous. a worse smell at all. So check it out. Today we got our new uh, Brita filter. It's the Brita Ultra Max. That's uh, pretty much just the thing you put in your fridge and you put the water up here in the top and uh, it filters through the little filters right here uh, and you get clean, cold water. Uh, we buy water bottles like all the time, as you can see, but we go through them so fast. Uh, I and I was like just like, bottles. yeah, I do too, but. You get to know how much you're drinking. Like in the morning, I'll be like, I'm gonna have a full water bottle in the morning. And then I'm like, yeah. But at the same time, we go through them so fast. Yeah. And this way, like, I mean, it, it's only like two bucks for like a 24 pack of waters, but still, like after a while, I, I pretty much paid that thing off. And what we'll do is we'll keep some of these water bottles we have and just refill them back up. Uh, so that way it'll save a little money in the long run. Uh, and it's nice to have fresh cold water. I, I just almost forgot about to, to shut the fridge. I'm about to walk off. You we don't live in a barn. You always do that. All right, we're gonna play a game. A game. I don't know what the name of it is. All right, I'm gonna say two different things, like random objects or things, and you try to answer with which one you think you are more like. So it could be something random, like the ocean or the sky. Which one are you more like? Okay. And not what other people think about you, what you think about you. The ocean. You're more like the ocean? Oh yeah. Why? And to explain. Because water is unpredictable. It's well, I mean, the sky is unpredictable, but you could be talking just the sky, not wind, which is what I think of when I see the sky. Anyway, unpredictable. There's times where it's calm. There's times where it's crazy. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I just I I personally think that I like really connect with the ocean in general. I would say I am more like the sky. Uh, just for the fact of me, like, when I'm outside and it's night, I like to look up at the stars. Well, I love looking at the stars, but that's and I like the, the sky, sunset. that's the universe. No, if that's we the get sky. Mr. It's the sky. I'm more, I'm just saying, that's I why I feel like stars. I'm more like the sky. I love the stars. I really but do. You, but you're definitely more like the ocean, I'm though. definitely more like the ocean, but the stars are beautiful. Alright, now you picked, uh, two options for me to Fire do. or water. Fire or water. Hmm. That's a hard one. <laughs> no, hard. I, I guess not. I'm not like fire at all. I'm I'm like water. Yeah, you're very I'm, calm. Yeah, calm collected. and collected. Not collected. <laughs> fire is crazy. It destroys things. Well, both I do crazy the complete if opposite you think of that. About it. Water can yeah, be destructive but as well. I would say I'm more like water. I'm definitely like water. Yeah. Because I'm yeah. not full destruction. I don't know. Have you seen your room before you painted it? <laughs> You're like fire. <laughs> no, I'm water. Water destroys too, but it's yeah. also calm, so I'm water. Water erodes stuff. It does it slowly. <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> okay, <laughs> here's a funny one. Are you more like uh, underwear or panties or bras? <laughs> uh, hard one. <laughs> Probably more like a bra. I wait. Does this? I think this question is pretty much gonna say, "What's our favorite preference?" <laughs> no, I mean if we're talking preference, prefer, preference, <laughs> <laughs> preference. Preference. I don't know what my preference is. I don't know, but I'm more like a bra where I'm supportive and helpful. <laughs> <laughs> and underwear is just like it's just a strand of. I would say Aww. I would say I'm more like underwear Why? because I can be annoying at times. Yeah, <laughs> but I do it. Like I do thong. it on purpose. <laughs> I'm like a thong. thong. 
<laughs> no, I'm like boxer briefs. <laughs> I know. I really like boxer briefs. Like, if no. I were a dude, I would wear boxer briefs. I would never wear boxer briefs. We have this ongoing argument about boxers. Have we not lied about that? No, I don't think so. I don't know if we have. I don't understand how any guy can wear boxer briefs. I how think... you can keep it... <laughs> Let me get my argument out. How you can keep it scrunched up like that in a little ball... And not have it freely dang dangling around and like having room to move around. I get frustrated if my boxers are just a little bit too high. Because oh, it's the most annoying feeling. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm See, talking about. See, though, I think uh, uh, that if I were a dude, I would like boxer briefs. But I you're think not a dude. Slapping everywhere. Yeah, but I have boots. It is not an uncomfortable thing. Things. It is not uncomfortable for you to be flapping everywhere. It's uncomfortable for it to be bunched How up in a little ball. Yeah, but then. Because you don't know, you don't understand. When you get hot, and then you're like, gotta like okay. maneuver it with you boxers. Think if it's, with boxer briefs, okay. it's like. It's a constant, nice, lovely little shell. No, it's not. Okay, you think if I'm <laughs> hot and sweaty and they're bunched up in a little ball, it's not going to sweat? No, it's going to sweat and it's all going to be stuck together. It's going to suck. I just, we have this ongoing thing. I win. I win. We Boxer have this briefs ongoing argument. Why? Why? And I'm getting, I, I get annoyed with him because he won't even give them a chance. I will never wear a box of Because yeah, like, I'm going to go freaking crazy it. within yoga 30 seconds wearing them. It's going to, it's going like, to feel... Yes, yoga, yoga pants are the best thing. <laughs> it's like the best invention in history. <laughs> Anyways, boxer briefs ain't happening. I would if I was a dude. Are you like a beanie or baseball cap? Uh, That's a really shitty one. <laughs> but I'm, I know my answer. I'm more like a baseball cap. Definitely not like a beanie. I'm I don't like beanie. beanies. I love beanies. Why? Because they're comfortable. Why are you? So you're comfortable? I'm comfortable. I don't care You gotta relate it to like you and your personality. Like why are you more like a beanie than a baseball cap? Because I'm a comfortable person. <laughs> I'm more like a, a baseball cap. I like beanies better. Actually I like I'm baseball cool. caps too. Cool. <laughs> They're not that cool. Yeah. <laughs> Sneakers or barefoot? I'm definitely not barefoot. That's nasty. That's so Walking nasty. around with bare feet. It's not nasty. The only nasty we're, part we're is hobbit like, feet. We're like picking two things. We're saying which one's our favorite to do. <laughs> no, I'm also relating it to me. You, you want me to go? I'm I'm the, I'm sneakers because I like to be covered up. I like like you guys. I've had people like comment. They're like, that. why do you wear sneakers it or shoes in your house? I hate I, when people wear shoes I, in my house. <laughs> I like wearing shoes. I don't like to not have shoes. It drags on. dirt in and all. I don't the care. Floors that are clean. That's what carpet cleaning is for. No. Yes. You ain't cleaning this damn carpet or the damn floor. It's annoying. You know? Anyway, I'm barefoot. I like to be free. I love my. Okay, barefoot. Oh, you like to be free, but you want to put these things. That's awkward. My zipper is on. <laughs> <laughs> you want to put those things in a little hammock and keep them balled up, but you like to be free, huh? I like to be free. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm saying, like, okay, well, first of all, when it comes to shoes and stuff, like, literal thing, I hate wearing shoes. I cannot stand it. My feet feel like they're trapped, and I'm just like, bitch, get off my feet. But then, in regards to myself, I'm just like, it's going to sound stupid, but I've always been, like, a very free-spirited person and, like, just... Down to earth. I like being close to earth as close as possible, and I don't like like distance. I don't know. It's a really. It's just bare. I'm just barefoot. Okay. <laughs> nasty. <laughs> it's not nasty. It's nasty if you make it nasty. All right. Here's a good one, or at least I think so. Do you think you're more like a tree or more like grass? A tree. Why? Just because, like, tr grass is just. It gets cut down all the time by mean people. What if it's wild grass? It doesn't get cut. Still a tree. A tree, it takes a long time. Well, it doesn't really necessarily take a long time to grow, but it grows and it kind it's of has It's really, wisdom. really slow compared to grass. Uh, no, I know. I was saying it takes a long time to grow. Wisdom? You ain't got no wisdom. What are you talking about? <laughs> I know I don't. Not yet. I have to wait until I'm an old, 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 old person and then I'll have all the wisdom I need. But I just, I feel... I don't, it's just a sense of like feeling connected to like the earth like grass is cool and shit but trees are like where is that yeah i think i'd be a tree uh you grow trees, and trees do feel wisdom, like wisdom yeah, like they, thing trees remind Circle me of wisdom of life connection yeah. family just like yeah. everything it just you i hate grass forget that freaking grass out there <laughs> grass. i hate that so i ain't no grass <laughs> <laughs> that was a fun little game right that is kind of fun i like it can we play more Let's play more. Not tonight, though. I'm tired. <laughs> I am tired, too. I'm so bad. Hey, Mac. <laughs> he sticks his face in both of our faces all the time. He loves to give kisses. 
I don't like kisses from Mac and Chew. <laughs> you get up in my face. Oh, oh he just loves his Quit. Quit Quit looking. No more. No it's more. So I'm trying cute. to read my National Geographic magazine. Mac and Chew. Hi, be gentle. Look at me in the face. He wants attention. Oh. <laughs> He's like, I'll give you a bath, Dad. Your tongue is so rough. You crazy dog. You crazy <laughs> dog. All right, my dudes. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the vlog. If you haven't done so, if you're a new viewer, uh, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, we post videos Monday through Friday, youtube.com slash timeoffs. Uh, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of our future videos. Uh, and yeah, I guess I will see you guys on Monday. Uh, possibly this weekend with viewer mail. If not this weekend, probably next weekend. All right. See ya. Peace. Doses. Ty's iPhone help with the pirate gray. Working hard, doing vlogs, man, every day. Being funny, huh? What can I say? They help with everybody, man. Videos on the way. Subscribe today. Hit like and play.